Hello everyone, welcome back to Bonjour Cuisine, where you find all the best healthy, delicious, mouth-watering food recipes on YouTube. Today guys, I'm going to share with you how to make this delicious, juicy, roasted chicken. You are going to definitely enjoy this. You and your family will devour this. Now, I'm going to prepare this chicken the Caribbean way. Yes, guys. As you can see, I'm preparing a broth first. I am going to boil some water with some parsley, cloves, seasoning salt or garlic salt, whatever that you have handy. And uh, yeah, let it boil for about 20 minutes. In the meantime, let's go ahead and prep this chicken up. In my kitchen, guys, we do clean our chicken the Caribbean way. Yes, we do prep it prior to seasoning it up with some lime juice, vinegar, salt to tenderize the meat. Now, as you can see, I am slicing the chicken open from the back and I'm going to make sure that I rinse it first. Like you can see here, guys, I would not want to cook up this chicken as is. This is my preference and uh, if you don't agree with this process, as usual, you can go ahead and skip this step. But of course, if you would like your chicken to come out just like mine, go ahead and follow everything that you see in this video. This is how Caribbean people prep their chicken okay so when you go on vacation and you're biting your finger off uh yeah that's how we do it uh the chicken will taste super delicious because you give it some love okay guys now funny thing is i used to think that uh caribbean people are the only uh, folks who prepare the chicken this way but no there are many other cultures who actually do the same exact thing uh, they prep the chicken with some lime juice salt to tenderize it and rinse it under cold water give this a try i mean you should be able to uh try different things in your kitchen and uh, learn on learn it's okay to try different things and if it doesn't work for you go ahead and disregard it but i guarantee you if you have this problem when you cook your chicken it comes out dry boring uh stuff like that this will definitely solve the problem for you and of course you can thank me later um, those of you who prep your chicken this way i would love to hear from you place your comment in the comment box below tell me all about it and if you have a different way of cooking your chicken uh, I'd like to hear because I'm willing to try different things as well. Okay, guys. So now I am going to rinse the chicken uh, under cold water. Um, and the next step is I'm going to brine the chicken with the broth that I prepared. I mean, this broth smells super delicious. The kitchen smells so nice already. Um, like I said, just add some parsley, cloves, seasoning salt of your choice and brine the chicken for about five minutes now i don't know if i'm saying this correctly brining the chicken but uh all the caribbean folks you know how we call this nap chaude pour la bien chaude that's what we're doing here chaude pour la parce que nous pas les viennes sorti du vrai where all my haitian folks are so now let's get ready for the seasoning process now I have a bunch of dry seasonings, delicious stuff, um, southern blend. I have a uh, garlic seasoning, salt, Italian seasoning, chili flakes, pepper, and paprika. I'm going to add a little bit of butter into this and a little bit of my vegetable stock. I'm going to place it into the microwave for 30 seconds. And this is what you have, this delicious dressing, oh my gosh. Your chicken will taste super delicious if you do exactly what I did here. Okay, guys, and yes, it's not going to be dry. Yes, guys, can't you tell that this chicken is going to be amazing? <laughs> yeah, so take your time to rub uh, the um, seasonings all over the chicken. Now, I know what you're thinking. You're probably saying, oh my goodness, Taisha, that's too much seasonings. Well, let me explain to you. The chicken is not cut into little pieces. It's a good chunk of meat and it's a whole, it's a whole chicken. You need to add lots of seasonings because if you don't, the chicken's gonna taste boring. And I guarantee you, if you take your time to season up this chicken, you're going to love it. And I'm extra, this is what I'm doing. I'm poking this chicken to make sure that the seasons sink in into the meat. 
Now, if you did follow me throughout the whole process, go ahead and heat up your oven at 425 degrees and bake it for an hour. Yes, cover it up with the aluminum foil. Of course, make sure you keep an eye on it. And there you have it. You have this delicious chicken here. Uh, you can enjoy this with some friends. They're not gonna talk about you, girl. I mean, the only thing they're gonna say, oh my gosh, that chicken was moist, it was juicy, it was delicious, definitely. This is the recipe for you, okay? Now, uh, for those of you who are in Massachusetts, I do provide catering services. Send me an email. My email address is bonjourcuisinellc at gmail.com. Now, for those of you who are new on this channel, I do share tons of delicious recipes. Take a look around and I share the gospel life topics. Yes, guys, on here we eat spiritual and natural food. So consider to subscribe. Again, thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for more recipes right here on Bonjour Cuisine. Bye!